brand, and today we're making a great Christmas tree. You can even give these away as gifts. It's super fast, super easy, and super, super delicious. I'm making cherry dipped in chocolate. The ingredients for this dish are maraschino cherries with the stems on top, chocolate pieces, and white chocolate pieces for the decoration. And you're definitely gonna need a baking sheet with parchment paper or wax paper. I have melted chocolate so much in my lifetime and this is the easiest way to do it and it's my trick. I pop it into the microwave. I'm gonna pop them both in. And then I hit two minutes. I hit power level five because I want it 50%. I don't want one edge of it to get too bubbly or too done fast because it'll make it really chalky and be hard to work with. And I'm gonna start that. Here we go. Now take a look at that. That still does not seem to me to be done. It's gotta go in for another 30 seconds. It is too gloppy on my spoon. Okay, good enough for government work. Let's get making our chocolate dipped cherries. So there is one, nicely dipped. We put him on the tray. This is a messy recipe, so a lot of paper towels are helpful. I take a cherry with the beautiful long stem out of the jar, I dab him here, and then he gets dipped in the chocolate. Go take a swim. And then I twirl him. Bop, let the extra come down. I'm gonna go like this to have a cheat. And there he sits. Cherry, paper towel, chocolate, dippy do. Oops, he went in for a deep dive. Never fear, he's gonna get rolled around and we're saving him. This is gonna be that one little bite, you're just gonna be popping it in your mouth. I recommend this recipe for all those presents you wanna mail to like maybe grandma in the Midwest. That's where my grandmother lived. And we would make all kinds of things and send them to her from our kitchen. And she would do the same back. I think that's where my love of making homemade candies came from. Okay, clip the bottom here. Done. And one of the reasons you wanna do this is you wanna take little bites as you're going along. Uh, mm. There's a couple of tricks for decorating. You can grab a fork, which is what I like to do, and very thinly on the fork, you can spread it. I'm kind of glazing it through. See that? That's kind of neat. You can also do it with a toothpick. And I think that's probably more designer-ish because you have more control, you get to paint them. This is so fun to do. This is like the art project you get to do with your food. And you get to give them away as presents. They're gonna go fast. I love making things like this that I can share with my friends. If you have a special recipe you like to give away, tell me what it is, and I'm gonna try to make it. I love making these cooking videos, and I love all of your comments. They mean a lot to me. Okay, Picasso, what do you think? So you get the idea, I'm gonna put these in the fridge because they need to cool down and chill up for about 30 minutes. And in the meantime, I'm making my favorite drink with the cherry juice. I'm throwing ginger ale on some ice. Oh my gosh, check this out. And then comes in about a quarter cup of cherry juice. This is amazing. Okay, a little swirl there. How pretty is that? <laughs> It's fabulous. So Merry Christmas and enjoy your box of chocolates. This time you know what you're gonna get. <laughs> mm. Cheers.